I'm Gary Bryant. I'm the Senior Vice President of Sales for Ontario Bollards. Been with the company since its inception in 2013. My name is Danny Zanke. I'm the Managing Director here at Ontario Bollards. Ontario Bollards is a company that originated as a, a bollard installer. So a simple bollard is a yellow post in the ground that you'll see at most drive throughs That's the simplest form of a bollard. And that's how the company started, literally out of the president's garage. And uh, it evolved over the years. We've moved three times. And now, welcome to our new home. In the bollard family, there's probably 40 different types of bollards. And again, it starts at conventional yellow steel bolt-down bollards to galvanized pipe that gets buried in the ground with a bollard cover, a plastic bollard cover. Bollards are everywhere uh, that we go. They do protect assets, they do protect buildings, they do protect machinery. We supply other contractors that are installing bollards. It's actually grown to probably 60% of our business now is the supply side of the business. That being said, our crews are still busy 365 days a year installing bollards. Uh, about 30%, 40% of our products that we sell here are domestically made. But we have sourcing around the world, really. Um, we have two factories in Italy, we have a factory in mainland China, and we have a factory in Australia. K-rated bollard also has an acronym of, of anti-terrorism bollards. Not an acronym, but a pseudonym of anti-terrorism bollards, or hostile vehicle mitigation systems. And a K-rated bollard will stop a 15,000 pound truck going 50 miles an hour and shred the truck in two. That part of our business has evolved over the years and has now become a major part of our business. And Ontario Bollards is the only company in Canada that manufactures K-rated bollards. Six years ago, we would get one call a year for a K-rated bollard. Now we're getting three or four a week. You see it every day, unfortunately, in the news. People using vehicles as weapons. Um, and, and like I said, it's a, Canada has been isolated for many, many years. But you, you, everyone's seen the news reports through the USA and through Europe and major centers around the world where terrorism attacks, they use vehicles to, to hurt people or to hurt structures. And we have been very, very isolated here in Canada. But times are changing and it behooves the governments, whether it's municipal, federal, or provincial, to protect their citizens in gathering places. Bollards are typically used to protect a sensitive piece of equipment from forklift impact. The guardrails are used to protect pedestrians. Traditional guardrail up to about four years ago was steel. The plastic product is relatively new. We're the first company to bring it to Canada. We brought it here about four years ago. Steel guardrail is just that, it's steel. And with steel comes inherent problems. It's gonna rust, it's gonna require maintenance. Even if it's not impacted, the paint will flake off and chip, particularly if it's in a moist environment. The MPM product is food grade. It'll withstand an impact, never needs painting, won't rust. It's just, it is the way of the future. Lately, we've been working a lot with uh, larger companies um, like Ellis Don, PCL, Canadian, uh, and uh, Leeswood. Those are the larger GCs that we seem to be working with. I know it's, we like the way we operate. Uh, we get in, we do the project, and we're out. Uh, there seems to be, there's never any deficiencies, and um, that's what they like. We did a major project last year or the year before for the City of Ottawa, for the City Hall. Uh, we've done a project in Edmonton for the Rogers Centre. A lot of these ballers, the inquiries that we get are engineered and the engineered ones obviously require custom fabrication and we do that all in house uh, in our shop uh, where we fabricate uh, according to your needs. What distinguishes us from others is our service and it's not just we don't just say service it's it's what starts from the start to the end and what happens after that as well. We'll take on a project and everything that we do from start to finish is something the way I would you know I would personally want to see a project done for me and that is basically it's, it's, it's executed from the start that you have a professional crew of people doing this. It's run professionally, it's always clean and maintained on site, and if there's any issues, they're addressed in one phone call. 
um, that is something that we pride ourselves big time on. And uh, if there's ever an issue after, we've been known to go after and repair anything that's even though it has nothing to do with us, just for goodwill. So we mandate all our inside salespeople to respond to customers' inquiries within 24 hours, without fail. And if anybody doesn't get that level of service, I want to know about it. I want to hear about it. If I, if I had to pinpoint it down to one facet of the business that makes us different than everybody else, it's that. It's that we treat our customers with respect, we give them the information they want, and we give it to them fast. To me, um, that's what drives the business, is the passion of what I do. Um, this is not a job to me. This is passion. This is what I do. This is what I love to do. Thanks for your time today. Don't forget to check out our website at OntarioBallers.com. Send us an email, give us a call, we'd be happy to hear from you. Thank you.